brother of mine. I've actually known him for about 10 years in, uh, in Haiti. But the last five years, I really got to know him uh, so much better. He's worked with us uh, here in Orange. Uh, helped us out interpreting. Uh, he gets up and uh, does interpreting for our pastors, ourselves. Uh, he works with medical team, VBS. He's constantly doing whatever needs to be done. And he came to me, uh, he's spoken about this before, but he came to me just a couple of months ago and said, I, I just know that the Lord is calling me into seminary. And uh, so we started sending him to school. And the reason I wanted you to meet him is because he needs help. Uh, he needs books, he needs uh, tuition, and it's expensive in Haiti as anywhere else. He's uh, got a, a, a wife and uh, two children, and uh, so it's, it's very difficult for him. But uh, if you'd like to help him, just uh, contact us and we'll show you exactly how you can help a young man finish seminary here in Haiti, and I'm sure that he'll be working uh, closer with us. Uh, we've got two churches going on right now that are Jerusalem 3 and 4 that are nothing but lean-tos. Who knows, he could be the pastor of one of those one day. Simon, how, how, uh, how do you like going to school? So, you know, I like going to school because I feel that God calls me to do His job and, uh, you know, um, in the vision, God chose me, you know, and called me to do uh, His job. And I'm, I say to God, I'm ready to do it. I'm ready to do whatever He tell me to do. And I appreciate Brother Chuck so much because uh, when I was talking with him and uh, he was very interesting about sending me to school also. And I, I give thanks to everyone in advance who wants to help me. Um, so I greet you also in the precious name of Jesus Christ. All right, thank you. Again, if you want to help Simon here, just let us know. We'll show exactly how you can do that and we'll give you progress reports on how he's doing with his school and pictures of his family. Thank you so much and God bless.